Hello, and welcome to the Untitled Cooking Show. I'm your host, Evan A. Estrada, and damn do I have a good meal for you today. So today, we're going to be cooking the vegan energy soup. And for that, we're going to need a couple of things. One, fresh cut green beans. Two, any can of your desired energy drink. Today we have Rip It Energy Fuel. We're gonna need some broccoli. If you don't have broccoli, then you shouldn't make this. We have this old carrot. It's a little, little gross. We have one very small tomato, but it's the largest tomato I could find. And we have one unpeeled onion that's definitely gonna make me cry. Some of the tools we're gonna need today are a handy dandy knife. Two, a spoon. Three, my favorite tool, the all-in-one spatula. Four, a pot, and a bowl. Let's begin. So we're gonna start off with our cold preparation. We're gonna start off with our carrot. We're gonna start here, make sure to chop the carrot into little pieces. Some of them can go on the floor, it's okay. I'm actually cutting the cutting board right now. Boom, carrot, done. Next we're gonna go with our tomato. We're gonna cut it once, down the middle. Notice how the tomato juice is spilling out. That's a sign of a half decent tomato. We're also gonna move these out of the way. Next, we're gonna go to our onion. This is my favorite part, because I really love peeling onions. We're gonna peel this onion. And uh, I'll get back to you in a year. Now that we have the onion peeled, take all the scraps, throw them away. I'm gonna chop the onion right in half. Look at that, how beautiful is that? I can feel the tears coming. So now, we're gonna kinda push it off all the layers just like this. So we have lots of little pieces of onion. This might take a little bit, but it's definitely worth it because you don't want big chunks of onion in your soup. Big chunks? Chunks. Shut up, cameraman. You're not supposed to talk. Now, just make sure that when you're uh, getting rid of all this onion, just to break the large pieces into smaller pieces, and I can uh, feel my eyes burning right now, it's actually quite horrible. Last product to chop. <laughs> the broccoli, okay? I like to just rip the trees off. And I like to pretend I'm ripping off people who I don't like, like their limbs, you know, arms, legs. Okay, now we've got all the good broccoli. All this nice green stuff right here. That's what we're gonna put in our soup. Now, we're gonna move on to the fresh cut beans. We're gonna need our handy dandy can opener. I have an electric one because I'm just that fancy, but um, uh, you do not need to have an electric can opener. Yeah, so I know how to use this. I definitely know how to use this one. Shit, your power's gone. Due to budget cuts in the studio, um, we're opening this with a knife. Maybe not. Go on scissors. See, this is my favorite cooking utensil now. This is always you, so I told you. So yeah, I've made this perfectly shaped hole. We're just gonna take some of this, take some of this, pour it in. Now we've totally emptied this can. We're gonna take our vegetables, just scoop them, all of them, right here, right in the pan. All the vegetables. All the tomatoes, all the carrots. Every single one of them. Because we don't waste food here, ever. We make sure to eat all of our food every single little drop. Now, we have totally finished our cold cooking. All we have to do is add the liquid. Delicious, added it right there into the soup. I like to go two cans at a time because it's faster and more efficient. Oh, I can smell how delicious this is gonna be already. Folks, you guys are not going to be disappointed, okay? I'll tell you that much. 
It's really looking like three cans is all we need today, which is good. I'll drink the fourth one with my meal. Now, let's put it on the burner. Okay, folks, now for the hot stuff. We're gonna put this on our nicely, freshly cleaned stove top, and we're gonna turn the heat all the way up. Yeah, there we go. We're just gonna mix a little bit of it in while we still can. Make sure to get nice and fresh, you know, squeeze a little. We're just gonna let it sit for a while. I'll get back to you soon. Now that we're reaching the final stages of our cooking, we are gonna add the spices. We're going with a little bit of salt and pepper today. We just like to, I'm, I'm a fan of salt, so we're just gonna pour a little bit in there. And uh, we'll pour a little bit of pepper in there too. We just take our spoon and mix it in a little bit. When we get back to you, we will be at the table, ready to eat. We are currently waiting for our food to be served by our slave. He's going to come in soon and present us with the great vegan energy soup. Shipped in right from Guantanamo Bay. This is my co-star and special guest today, Connor Whelan. He's here to dine on my fine cuisine. I'm here to die on your fine cuisine. Dine. <laughs> I die. Connor, what are you expecting? I don't know. Based on what I watched, I'm expecting something really salty. Something really salty. No, I only added the perfect amount of salt. I'm going to explain a little bit to you since he doesn't know what's in my masterful soup. So we added the standard, the standard things like vegetables. And we also added a little bit of spice for our broth. We added the very special ingredient of dollar store energy drinks. Oh my <laughs> fucking god. It's going to be delicious. Thank you, Slade. I didn't expect that. <laughs> We're going to watch Connor eat our delicious soup. That's steamy. You can take your uh, bowl now, Connor. Oh no. <laughs> oh my god. It looked good before. <laughs> Taking this very seriously now. Gonna take the first bite. Gonna get a little bit of extra broth in there. Hey, you actually did a good job with the vegetables. Just the carrots. And... It's very hot right now. I'm gonna let it, let it cool down. So Connor, while you're waiting for your uh, soup to cool down, now that you know what's in it. What do you? What are you expecting? Oh my god, it's foul. <laughs> what he meant to say was, it smells delicious. It's, uh, it's a delectable treat for the whole family. <laughs> oh man, I didn't expect that. <laughs> ready for this delicious treat? Connor, you ready? We got, we're gonna try it on the same time, so get a, a nice spoon. I think it's a little hot. Hold on. Right. It's hot, but it isn't too hot. Ready, set, go. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh. Mm. Delicious. Oh, it's so crunchy. Another masterful meal made by the finest chef in North America. <laughs> That's delicious. It really is delicious. Oh. That's bad. It smells horrible. And it's like really sweet and weird. Well. Let's finish this out. Thank you all for joining us on uh, this culinary journey. Uh, come back in a couple of weeks or next week. I don't know. Come back sometime for our next episode of the Untitled Cooking Show. I will be here with a new guest ready to make a new chef. You want to redo your outro? So now that we've uh, finished eating this delectable soup, uh, I'd just like to let you guys all know that I'm very thankful that you guys joined me on my first culinary journey into, um, I mean, this isn't my first culinary journey. I've cooked many of times. I'm a master chef. First culinary journey for this channel. Come back next week for our next dish.